Hey guys, it's Erica from Erica Marie Plans. Welcome back to my channel for another memory plan with me. Um, these past couple weeks, I've been trying to get at least one video uploaded, which I think I've been on it the past three weeks, which I mean, it's not the best, but it's better than nothing, I think. Um, and honestly, with everything that's been going on lately, I actually have a lot more time on my hands now that school is obviously canceled for most places i don't know if it's like everywhere right now but i think most places schools cancel so currently not working and actually my other job at lululemon is also out so we are closed um for the next two weeks too so i have no work which is crazy because i've literally worked since i've been in high school and i've never not had a job so I feel like I'm in high school again. Like I have no adult, well, I mean, I guess I do have some adult like um, responsibilities, but other than like working, I don't have any work responsibilities, which is so weird to me. So um, also I can hear my dog trying to get in my room, <laughs> but I kicked him out cause he was like just wandering around. So anyway, he's probably gonna be knocking at my door soon. Um, but yeah, so this is for the week of January 20th through, I think the 26th, yeah. Um, I was still in Arizona during this time, I actually came home this week, and so that's why I decided to use this kit from SPC, which is like a travel kit, and it is called, so let me look it up, sorry, um, it's called Take Me Away. Um, I purchase this kit just because honestly I loved the theme of it. I loved the way everything worked out and like was just put together. I loved all the colors, especially the blue. I just think it worked super well. And I didn't know the next time I'd be traveling. I do actually have travel plans, but obviously those are no longer in the works because of everything that's been going on. So um, I just thought now would be a good time to use it for this week because I was traveling this week and I don't know when the next time I will be traveling anymore so yeah I just wanted to use it for then um also I use some day extenders and the bougie boxes are from SPC um and I also used some overlays from I think they're oh from one no from letters to Apollo and then I actually used a wiggle I think this was like her second wiggle she ever released it's like the um, aqua blue or teal blue I don't know but I think it was like her second wiggle that she ever released um, yeah also if you see that on my finger I know it's kind of gross um, it's still there now but um, I got that from work I was tying balloons and my finger just was so this sounds gross but it got so raw from just tying balloons all day at work and it wasn't even all day I like tied 10 balloons and then I looked at my hands and it was bleeding um so yeah they were just so raw and dry from like washing them constantly so that's why that happened um so hopefully my next plan with me will be gone but yeah okay so let's go ahead and get into the day by day i actually this the way this first box looks it's gonna change i ended up changing a lot of things <laughs> throughout this plan with me that i kind of edited out but um yeah okay so first thing on monday i marked that i had a headache um I used an emoji and a headache script from Kinsey's Creations. And then also, I'm just going to go ahead and move down because I'm going to end up changing it anyway. But in the second box, I marked that um, we actually had like a little, kind of like, <laughs> I wrote Russian history. Um, the people that we were staying with um, in Arizona um, is my boyfriend's best friend. And so his wife is from Russia and so she was just like teaching us a bunch of like stuff about Russia and like showing us YouTube videos and stuff so I just thought it was funny to put like we had a Russian history lesson um I also washed my hair this day and I used a fox and cactus hair washing girl to mark that I also took a nap but in the end I ended up taking up that sticker because there just wasn't enough room to put everything else um and then moving back up on top I marked that it was also Martin Luther King Day and that script is from SPC along with the sleep in script, which is from SPC. Um, we also had a pizza night. We ended up going to this restaurant that we've been hearing good things about. It's called Oregano's, I think. Yeah, I believe it's Oregano's. 
in um, Santan Valley in Arizona, and so we went there for dinner, and it was so good. Um, they have like a, essentially a pizuki there too, like their version of pizuki, and honestly, it's kind of better than BJ's pizukis. Um, and then to end our night, we kind of hung with friends. We went to uh, some other friend's house that we went to high school with and just kind of hung out. And then it was really cool because we all went to high school together. Um, and it was just kind of fun catching up. We also had some banana bread. Um, our friends had also made banana bread that night. And so I took we took some home. And then me and um, Dean's friend's wife so I guess we're kind of friends she um watched this show watches the show Frankie and Grace on Netflix and so I ended up watching it with her and having some tea and then we ended our night watching deep I think it's called deep waters um on it wasn't on Netflix I think we just streamed it Dean and I and then ended up passing out moving on to Tuesday Tuesday I used another emoji to mark that I slept in and then also things kind of got a little squished because I, there was a lot I wanted to fit in for this day. Um, I marked with a munchkin that I packed up my stuff because this was the day I was leaving to come back home. Uh, my boyfriend was staying down in Arizona for I think like three more weeks and so it was time for me to come home because I had to work the next day. I couldn't take that much vacation. Um, we also had some cuddle time before I left. And I also marked that I had a day off from work, just to indicate that I took some vacation time. Um, and then before going to the airport, we stopped at Chick-fil-A to grab something to eat, because my flight wasn't until, I think, like 5 o'clock. And then um, I also got stopped by TSA. I knew I would. I got this lotion um, when I had my massage that weekend. Uh, I was able to take home the rest of my like lotion that they used on me, which was like a full size lotion that was super expensive. And I knew I wasn't going to be able to take it because it's like a very large bottle, but my boyfriend insisted on me trying to sneak it in. But I'm like, you can't sneak in things like that because they will catch it. Sure enough, they caught it and I had to go out and they had to like search my bag. And it was just really annoying because I was kind of late to my flight. Like, I didn't get to sit down or go to the bathroom before and I had to go to the bathroom so bad and so I didn't get to go to the bathroom before getting on the plane and I didn't want to go on the plane so I just held it and it's only like an hour and a half flight and I have what people call a teacher bladder so I can hold my pee for quite a while so I ended up just holding it the whole flight but I was kind of mad and then I flew home from Phoenix to Sacramento and once I got home, my dad picked me up and he picked me up in my own car, which I was kind of like upset about, but I was like, whatever. And then in the end, he ended up filling up my tank, which was super nice. And so I marked that with an emoji. And then once coming home, I went straight to my best friend's house, Gabby, to go hang out and just kind of talk. And then her husband, Austin, made us dinner that night. So I used a munchkin to mark that. I am kind of really behind just noticing now. Okay, moving on to Wednesday. Wednesday was my first day back at work, so I used a Papershire teacher girl to mark that. I also had to call the doctors, and then I was just really irritated with the doctor. They kept telling me to call these different doctors to get a hold of what I needed to, the person that I needed to get a hold of. It was just kind of, it was a long, long process, so I used a phone icon to mark that. I also had Chipotle for dinner this night, and the Chipotle burrito sticker is from the Coffee Monsters Co., and the Chipotle script is from Kinsey's Creations. I also took a nap this day before going into Lululemon that night. Um, I used a nap script from Kinsey's Creations and a paper and milk Maru. Maru? I always, I do that every single plan with me. I don't know. I always forget if it's Maru or Maru. I think it's Maru. And then also I used a munchkin at the very bottom that is like kind of stressed out because I almost got hit this day. <laughs> um, yeah, it was super late at night. I think it was like two o'clock in the morning when I got off work and we just, I don't know. It was, it wasn't done on purpose, but it was one of my coworkers were just trying to get out of the parking lot. And I don't think she noticed that I was driving and I definitely had the right of way. And so I had to step on the brakes and I don't think she even noticed like after that I was right there. So that's what happened. Moving on to Thursday. Thursday I was late to work. Um, I'm hardly ever late to work, but I was late this day. My I was just so tired because I got off at 2 and I had to work at 7. 
so I just slept through my alarms and I was freaking out, but it happens sometimes. Luckily, I have another teacher I open with, so she was there on time, which thankfully she was. <laughs> um, so yeah, so I used a munchkin to mark that I was running late. I also did a face mask this night, and the face mask script is from um, Pixie Doodle and Bear and an icon from SPC. I had some planning time, and I used a planning script from SPC, and the icon is from Sadie Stickers. And it was also payday, so it's really small, but I thought it fit like perfect in that little small area. I also did laundry. The laundry script is from Letters to Apollo, and um, I think the laundry icon... I believe that's from Rose Color Days, just from like a sampler I got a while back. Um, I also did some filming this day. This day was like jam-packed. There was a lot of things I couldn't fit in this day, so I kind of just put the things that were like kind of big. Um, but yeah, I did some filming, and that film script is from Avenue K Designs, which she is no longer open. Um, I also had sushi. I called it in right before I got off work and went to go pick it up from my favorite sushi place. And then the sushi foiled stickers are from SPC, and then the PK is a custom from Kinsey's Creations. I also edited a haul, and the edit haul is from Letters to Apollo, and the icon is from SPC. Moving on to Friday. Friday, I think, was payday again, yes. So that's why I usually go grocery shopping on paydays. Um, so did some grocery shopping this day. The grocery run script is from SPC along with the icon. Um, I did some meal prepping, which I don't think technically it was meal prepping. I just cooked a dinner, but I wanted to use the meal prep sticker because I have so many of those. So I used that and a paper shutter furl. Um, I also filmed a plan with me this day, and that is from Letters to Apollo. And this day, I posted it on my stories obviously back in January, but, um, Erin Condren, I was not very happy with, um, my planner was messed up, um, I think I talked about it a while back, but, like, when I didn't notice it until this day, because this was the day I was like, okay, I'm gonna start filming in my new planner with, so I could have, like, my New Year's Eve and day spread in this planner, but obviously I didn't end up doing that, because my Erin Condren 2020 was missing a page, and I was very irritated. So I had to just deal with that, and they fixed it. They did everything they did was, like, right to fix the whole situation, so I am happy about that. I also had the day, or the night off, but I used a day off script from SPC and a paper shower girl. Um, I guess we ended up not needing a lot of people that day at Lululemon, so I ended up having the night off, which was super nice, and whenever we have a night off, we do end up making the making up those hours that were missed in another day, which is super nice, so you're not really getting cut, you're just getting your hours placed somewhere else when they need you at a different time, which is really cool, and it was also payday, and I also had some tea, and I watched some YouTube videos to end my night. Moving on to Saturday, Saturday I had some morning coffee, and the coffee is from Paper Shire. I also had a meeting with my store manager at Lululemon, and the meeting went so well, and this was the day she offered me a permanent position at the store, which was so awesome. Um, not a lot of people got to stay on after the holidays, but I'm just like so grateful that I'm able to stay on. I absolutely love working there. Um, and so I was just really happy. And then to kind of celebrate, I'm like, you know what? I'm going to go shopping. We just got paid. So I went shopping. I think this was like the last big shopping day I had at Lululemon. So I kind of spent a lot. But I love it. I love Lululemon so much. Um, So the shopping script is from SPC and the bags are from a GP sticker studio. I also had the best salad ever. This was the first day I've had my salad. And I actually just had one tonight. It's the Pasadena salad from Trader Joe's. Oh my god, it's my favorite salad. Um, and then I also, everything's kind of marked out of order because it was the only way it was going to fit. But I made lunch prior to take to work. And then I also had a Grey's Anatomy binge to end my night. Moving on to Sunday. Sunday I made a latte and some fried rice. Um, also this day was not a very joyful day. This was the day actually Kobe Bryant had passed away. Um, so I just wanted to mark it in there just to, I don't know, kind of remember it. Um, 
and then I later on that day I actually changed my profile picture on my Instagram which I hadn't done in like four years and so <laughs> I wanted to change it it's actually my current picture on my channel too so I kind of I think I have that picture everywhere I think it's on my personal Instagram and my like planner Instagram too so I changed my picture which I wanted to mark because like I said it had been years since I changed it I also did some tidying up and watched The Bachelor this day and we had a taco night and I think the taco icon is from Magic Prince Co but yeah so that completes this plan with me like I said in the beginning I am off work so I have hella time to be filming these plan with me so I have no excuse to be not posting um, especially during this time at least for me I know I want to see a lot of videos because I have a lot of downtime and so I have a lot of time to do some YouTube binges and some plan with me binges so I'm going to be helping you guys out too by posting some of mine so maybe you guys can be watching those because I, that's what I like to do on my free time so I hope you guys enjoyed this make sure to follow me on Instagram to see close-ups of everything which is Erica Marie plans and make sure to subscribe if you are not already and like this video and i will see you guys in my next plan with me all right bye guys